Prokaryotes are microscopic single-celled organisms, including bacteria and archaea. Prokaryotes are everywhere. If you looked, you'd find bacteria on every object around you. One reason bacteria are so ubiquitous is that they multiply very rapidly. How do they multiply so quickly? Let's look more closely at prokaryotic cell division. Prokaryotic cell division is a process by which a cell divides into two or more cells. The process of prokaryotic cell division is called binary fission, which is a simpler process than found in eukaryotes. Recall that prokaryotes differ from eukaryotes due to the lack of a nucleus or cell organelles. Typically, their chromosomes consist of a single loop or circle of DNA. The circular DNA molecule replicates. It then attaches each copy to a different part of the cell membrane. The cell grows to twice its size and the membrane pinches in the middle. The cell can now undergo binary fission. Binary fission is the prokaryote form of asexual reproduction. After the cytoplasm divides, each daughter cell synthesizes a new cell wall, creating two identical cells. Binary fission results in two cells that each contain one copy of the original circular DNA. Prokaryotes are able to multiply rapidly because of their small size. Their DNA takes a short time to replicate, and with a high surface area to volume ratio, they can absorb nutrients quickly. Also, the relative simplicity of the cell's internal organization allows rapid duplication. A bacterium can divide every 20 minutes in optimum conditions. Unchecked, bacterial population growth is exponential, allowing rapid colonization of a favorable environment. Scientists can apply knowledge of prokaryotic cell division in disease prevention and care. Through the use of antibiotics, doctors and scientists can slow or stop the growth of disease-causing bacteria. Some beneficial prokaryotes aid in digestion. Other prokaryotes play a role in the environment and are used for cleanup of toxic waste in bioremediation programs. It's no exaggeration to say that prokaryotes are an essential part of life on Earth.